Hello, this is Manny Hernandez from todaybeatis.com. Today has been a hard day. Actually, this whole weekend has been a bit rough. Uh, on Saturday, we learned about the passing of one of our members, Kyla Maldonado. Uh, I already wrote to everyone in the community about this, but um, because I wrote about it, it hadn't dawned on me until now how I personally felt about her passing. So I just wanted to share a little bit about that and also what um, what we can do to avoid things like this from happening. To the best of my understanding, Kyla passed away from um, complications arising from DKA. DKA stands for diabetes or diabetic ketoacidosis. Um, this happens when there's an excess amount of ketones uh, that result from the complete uh, starvation of the body cells uh, of their glucose, of the glucose that runs in our bloodstream. And this can typically occur when we're sick we are sick and we have uh, because of a, an infection or being sick we have an excess uh, high blood sugar when uh, we don't take uh, adequate insulin doses to cover for blood sugars in our bloodstream when uh, we are, have not yet been di diagnosed with diabetes and have very high high blood sugars I um, should have said very high blood sugars and due to stress so um, for the most part these are things that are in our control uh, obviously we can't control getting sick at times but we can control keeping an eye on things while we are sick and we definitely can control making sure that we take the right doses of insulin it may be very hard to you know, learn when we have diabetes if we are unaware about it. So one thing we can control, one thing we can do, is uh, to raise awareness about diabetes and make sure that other people realize how delicate this is and how important is it for us to not take it lightly. And stress most certainly surrounds us every day of our lives, but uh, uh, we can we can act and do th things about it and realize that there are more important things in life and uh, well life itself is one of them so um, I mean this is so true it was true before today before this weekend and it is it continues to be true DKA diabetes diabetic ketoacidosis can kill so please take care of you guys um, I don't know if uh, the combination, I guess, of the fact that Kyla was the first member in the community that we learned um, she had passed away, or because um, she was a fellow person with diabetes, or altogether because uh, it just makes me realize or remember once more how fragile we all are. So, just take care of yourselves, guys. You know, uh, let's let's make sure we keep an eye on each other and help each other out and continue to grow as a family and you know grow healthy and get old healthy because uh, having diabetes doesn't equate a death sentence. So, please take care of you guys. Um, well, we dedicate uh, to Kyla this podcast. I'm just gonna end it like quietly. <laughs>